I have a simple job planned for this evening. Break into a guarded mansion, steal another fat nobleman's priceless trinket, and leave quietly. Lord Bafford is out of town, and rumor has it that the captain of his house guard went with him as a bodyguard. The time is ripe for a bit of burglary. The front gate of Lord Bafford's manor is always guarded, and the main street is far too exposed. But Cuddy tells me there's a better way in, around to the side, more out of the way. One guard, and likely no witnesses to complicate matters. The piece Cuddy wants is a scepter, silver, jewels, the usual adornments. It should command a high price. Bafford, like most of his kind, probably keeps his treasures on the top floor of the place, close to his heart, and far from his servants. No point in waiting. I have Cuddy's old sketches of the place, and everyone who's going to be asleep inside already is. It's time to begin. Underslung cheek spikes. Last time I was there, there was a real eye gouge. <laughs> nah, nah. Make me sick. When I was a kid, huh, surprised you're even in this job. Ooh, the blood is in my poor tummy. Shut up, you taffer. <laughs> you should have been there years ago. Tell you. The bears, they, they were you something to see. Those bears. Who's there? Hello? Don't hurt me! There's a guy over here! Help me! I swear, I've never seen the river this low. Oh well, <laughs> too many imaginings. Oh well, sorry, guess it was nothing. No, no, don't let him get me!
that noise
It's a throne room. How pretentious can you get? something for myself.